The customer's objective, a packaging line to fill, cap, and label multiple shapes and size containers with minimal changeover. Universal Machine Company designed a one-size puck system that handles a variety of shape and size containers. These pucks are implanted with RFID tags for tracking accuracy and rejects. The results? The multiple sized puck container fill line. Here are the process and features of the multiple sized puck container fill line. An operator manually loads empty containers into Universal Machine Company designed puck. There are seven different pucks capable of handling 20 different container types. The pucks with the empty containers travel on a Universal Machine Company designed conveyor to an inspection station. Two cameras check to make sure the correct container is loaded and correctly oriented. As the pucks and containers continue, they are properly spaced using a set of Universal Machine Company spacing wheels to provide the correct distance between pucks to go across the first check weigher. This first weigh station measures the empty weight before filling. Later, the weight will be subtracted from the total weight after filling to check for proper fill volume. Containers are tracked using RFID tags that are permanently attached to each puck. Next, the pucks are indexed and positioned into the filler in groups of eight using a set of two Universal Machine Company servo-driven side belts. Containers are filled eight at a time using an inline filler. Once filled, the containers are indexed out using the same servo-driven side belts. Pucks are spaced to go across a second waiting station to check fill volume. Weight is compared to the weight from the first check weigher, tracked using RFID tags on each puck. An exclusive feature of all Universal Machine Company units is our multi-track cable management system that keeps communication, high voltage, low voltage, compressed air, and control cabling neatly separated throughout the length of the unit. To ensure proper orientation for the capper, the pucks are rotated 90 degrees. Pucks are again spaced apart using a set of Universal Machine Company spacing wheels, giving them the correct gap for the capper. Containers are inspected for a missing cap or incorrectly installed cap. Pucks and containers next flow through a Universal Machine Company designed lane changer. Good containers are shifted onto a second Universal Machine Company conveyor to go to depucking. Rejects are sent to the reject lane for rework. Containers are rejected for improper fill volume, missing cap, or incorrectly installed cap. Rejects are tracked through the line using the RFID tags on each puck. Good containers continue to two six-axis robots. These two robots remove the containers from the puck, correctly orient the containers for labeling, and place them onto the labeler conveyor. The labeler can apply label to the front, back, or either side of the containers. The containers are inspected again for correct label placement. Any improperly labeled containers are removed from the line with a Universal Machine Company reject pusher. Good containers continue to the end of the line where they are hand packed into boxes. The empty pucks are returned to the beginning of the line to be reloaded with empty containers, continuing the seamless workflow. Universal Machine Company design exceeded the customer's objectives to create a packaging line to fill, cap, and label multiple shapes and size containers with minimal changeover.